Kansas City, Missouri averages 1,800 water main breaks a year, and now the City Finance Committee wants voters to approve $500 million in bonds to fix the city's infrastructure. Sarah Hollenbeck is live at 39th and Broadway, where a water main break this morning caused a big mess. Sarah? That's right, Cynthia. And right now you can still see a lot of that water still in the street here. Take a look. And there is someone from the water services that's out here now trying to work to really fix the problem. I guess it has been fixed, but he's trying to make sure that everything is good out here right now. Now get this. The city averages 1,800 water main breaks a year. That's quite a few. The infrastructure here is hundreds of years old. And this weekend, city crews even fixed a water main break in front of City Hall. That pipe did dated back to 1879. So today, the Kansas City, Missouri Finance Committee paved the way for a $500 million water bond to be put out to voters on a ballot. Voters will be able to vote on this issue in April, and if passed, the city hopes those $500 million will help, help pay for repairs like this over the next 10 years. If it doesn't pass, city manager Troy Schultz says it could get even more expensive for the city to make these fixes. Uh, normally you measure water main breaks in breaks per hundred miles of line and we're in the breaks per mile of line. So that tells you uh, the age and the uh, benign neglect of the system over the past uh, uh, many decades and we've got to fix it. And city officials said today this is a problem they should have fixed as much as 50 years ago, but they simply didn't have the money available. Reporting live at 39th and Broadway, I'm Sarah Hollenbeck, 41 Action News.